How to fix Discord stuck on RTC connecting. Before trying any of the solutions in this video, try restarting your computer and resetting your router. If you have a third-party firewall solution, try whitelisting Discord or turning it off. And if you are using a VPN, try turning it off as well. Then check if that fixed the issue with Discord. If it didn't, try the following fixes. Solution 1. Check the Discord server status. Open your web browser and go to the Discord status web page. Check if all systems are operational. If they are, then the RTC connecting error is caused by an issue on your end. In which case, try the following solutions. Solution 2. Change your Discord server region. Open Discord. If you're the admin of your own Discord channel, select your server and click the cog icon next to a voice channel. In the Overview tab, scroll down and open the Region Override drop-down menu. Select the region nearest to you, Click Save Changes. Solution 3. Disable Quality of Service High Packet Priority. Open Discord. Open the User Settings menu. Under the App Settings category, click Voice and Video. Scroll down until you find Quality of Service. Toggle the Enable Quality of Service High Packet Priority slider off. Close the Settings menu. Solution 4. Allow Discord through Windows Firewall. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open the Run dialog box. In the Run dialog box, type in firewall.cpl and click OK to open Windows Defender Firewall settings. Click Allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Click the Change Settings button. Click Allow Another App. Then click Browse. Then, in the address bar, type in percent local app data percent backslash discord and hit enter. Select update.exe and click open. Click add. Make sure that the private and public checkboxes are marked. Click OK. Now Discord will be allowed through Windows Defender Firewall. Solution 5. Change the DNS server address. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. In the Run dialog box, type in ncpa.cpl and click OK. Right-click your network adapter and click Properties. Select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP IPv4 and click Properties. Tick the Use the following DNS server addresses option. Enter the following addresses, or your preferred DNS addresses. In the preferred DNS server, type in 1.1.1.1. In the alternate DNS server, type in 1.0.0.1. Click OK to save settings.
restart your PC for the changes to take effect. Solution 6. Perform a DNS flush. Navigate to the right side of the taskbar, right-click Discord's icon, and click Quit Discord. Then, hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type in CMD, and hold down Shift plus Control plus Enter keys to open Command Prompt as Administrator. In the Command Prompt window, type in IP config slash release, and hit the Enter key. Then, type in IP config slash flush DNS, and hit Enter. Lastly, type in IP config slash renew, and hit Enter. Reboot your computer. Solution 7. Perform a Winsock reset. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. Type in CMD and hold down Shift plus Control plus Enter keys to open the command prompt as administrator. In the command prompt window, type in NETSH, Winsock reset, and hit the Enter key. Reboot your computer. Hopefully, this video provided you with the information you were looking for. If you're using a Windows computer, we suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. Combo Cleaner's real-time anti-malware scanner will stop malware from gaining a foothold on your PC. Anti-ransomware protection will protect your most precious files against being encrypted by ransomware. Combo Cleaner's web browsing protection will block scams, malicious websites, and downloads. Also, Combo Cleaner's Duplicate File Finder and Big Files Finder will help you clean up your PC and save gigabytes of valuable disk space. Don't let malware wreak havoc on your computer. Download Combo Cleaner today. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.